Right, so what does a geography teacher do on a snowy day? They have to go outside. There's no way I was going to let such a good opportunity come to waste. Uh, it is snowing heavily now. Uh, well, the school is still open. I know some schools in Bristol have closed, but we're tough cookies here. And we will keep going. Um, but yeah, this is obviously the kind of surprise that we come to expect in a surprise. It's winter, it's normal for it to happen. But often people get surprised by the fact it starts to snow in March and it doesn't snow in November, December um, and February. And the main reason for this surprise is a lot of people forget that the winter officially starts on the 21st of December and finishes on the 21st of March. So we're in the middle of winter, really. Uh, approaching the end, to be fair, but we've just gone through the middle of winter. It was still very much in winter and so actually snow in November is very unusual. Snow in December and January is, again, uncommon because we've only just started winter whereas March we're, we're ending a season that has been very cold and uh, there's still some very cold air flowing around and in this case here we've got some arctic air maritime air coming from the north so cold and moist weather coming over the UK meaning we have a dollop of snow so yeah if you're like me a keen geographer this is an amazing day to be alive